What is going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Mr. KYV, and we are back with another video, man. Good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning. As I can see, we are milling today. Got a nice little job ahead of us. You already know we got gang on the job and everything. Starting the day off nice and easy, getting straight to the point. You already see that we milling, man. We out here, you guys know the vibes. Dump truck season is back. I cannot wait to bring you this content. Push out this content for y'all, so let's get in the truck and let's start our day. Let's go. Yee. All right, y'all. So I don't know if I ever did milling with y'all on the job. And I just want to make sure that we are all on the same page here. Typically when milling, one beep means stop, two beeps mean go. And what I typically do is, I don't know if you guys can see in that top mirror right there. What I like to do is I raise the tarp just a little bit. So that way, the all the asphalt chunks or the millings don't go inside of the body. Like, after the body. Or on top of the cab, I should say. We do not want that. And there's a guy in the machine, just like Paven, that will tell us to roll forward and when not to. I just want to make sure I got a clear view for you guys, you know? Probably going to be a little hard to see with the contrast of the light and everything. Kind of want to try and watch the pillar. That's on top of the machine, well, the, the chute. But when the chute is hard to see sometimes. Kinda wanna check both your side. I don't know if you guys can see that so well over there. Especially when you start hearing the chunks like that, that's how you know when you should roll up a little bit, you know? I don't know if you guys can shoot, see the chute nice and clear right there. probably end up doing a time lapse for the rest of these because like for milling it's, it's pretty simple you stay on the brake and you just level off the clutch and right now it looks like he's loading up the front of the truck or the nose of the nose of the body I should say so I want to try and keep the chute relatively close to my tailgate just so that way all the chunks go up as far as possible same type of angle, speed a few things up and everything. Right now we are rolling. Looks like he's gonna start milling back after the bridge. Pretty sure you guys got the gist of it and I'll explain more once we're done. Let's go. 
give you guys a better representation of what I mean. I rolled a tarp up just like this. And if y'all don't know, this is Quan right here on the job, yo. <laughs> he specifically always stays in the back just to clean up all the excess that's left over. When it's piled up like that, the Bobcat normally picks it up and puts it in the back of somebody's truck, typically any truck that's in front. And that's pretty much the gist of milling. I don't know if I've ever done a milling job on my channel, so if I haven't, here's the first, first of many. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. We're gonna get on going and let's go. All right, you guys, we are all loaded up and ready to go. We got our tag on the floor. And right now, we are headed back to drop off this load. We're gonna drop this load and we're gonna be on our way back for another. So. I figure some of y'all really enjoy the, the driving aspect and like hearing the, the jig and the engine. So I figured I'd do a little bit of that first and we just go about our day. The load feel kind of heavy, but it's probably not that bad. It's been so long. Mind you, we are coming from an off season, you guys. So you already know that your boy is not used to this. Pick up the tag, look at that. Super not used to this. Jump out the truck. We get that good angle of the body going down and everything. Yes, we are. So now that y'all see how the run is about to go, we are about to go back and head on for another one. And that's just how it's gonna be for the day. Not much to it. Like I said before, I hope you guys are enjoying the video. There's not much to record leaving the plant. So I'll probably catch you guys once we're outside the plant and get some shifting videos for you guys. Like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy, Mr. K Wave. I'm gonna catch you on the next clip. Yee yee!
at y'all. If you guys seen when we got back to the street over there, there was about everything was milled and done. So now we are out here going paving. And we are fully loaded right now with asphalt. We are headed out. We are going to go, I think our job is in East Granby. So we're gonna head over there to the job and see how everything goes. <laughs> I'm gonna catch you guys when we get there. <laughs> As y'all can see, we are now paving straight out of Millen. Um, I guess the street that they were gonna do after the street that we had finished was they had other work or other plans basically. So now we are doing what we are doing right now. The GoPro is currently at about 7%. Wasn't expecting to have to record a full day because sometimes um, about 30 minutes of recording for you guys is like two to three loads for me. to try and get you guys a lot of footage. But in today's case, because the things got switched up, I'll get at least one load of paving for you guys. So here it is. Um, you guys know how to pave and everything. For anybody that's new to my channel, um, if I have to re-explain paving, paving is um, laying down new asphalt on the ground. Um, the best way to explain dump truck perspective is keep your foot on the brake. And as they tell you to go up with the body, you raise it. If they tell you to go down with the body, you lower it. You always watch for wires above your head such as the one that we are under right now. Hope you guys are enjoying the video. I hope I explained to the best of my knowledge that I could. That's really about it. I don't know how well you guys can see the angle and everything. I just want to make sure it's good for you guys. officially died i've been carrying around i've been carrying around this camera lately just in case the gopro does die so that way i can end these videos properly and not just throw the black screen in but um we are on break right now we are probably gonna end up doing like two more loads of asphalt if you guys well obviously if y'all see in this part you have already watched at the end and i appreciate y'all for that like comment subscribe on the video um what else i want to tell you I think that's about it we got a whole season ahead of us of videos so i hope you guys are enjoying started off as a milling day and it ended as a paving day sometimes this is how things crumble and i don't think i got anything else more to tell you like comment subscribe on the video man and it's your boy mr k wave and we'll catch you on the next one peace Yee.